YouTube? It's your girl Jada Janae, and I am back with another video. And as you already see by the title, today I am gonna be showing y'all how I get my crimps. I'm also going to be showing telling this Julia hair. This is my very first time ever working with them, and y'all, I'm not gonna lie, I'm impressed. The hair is just so full and luscious. It's so full. But before we get into this video, I just want to tell you guys, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can be notified every time I post a video. And if you're returning, welcome back. But yes, yeah, pretty much not much to say. Let's go ahead and get into this video. I have another video of me crimping hair, but the hair was kind of like a colored type, color type situation. And this is my first time, you know, crimping like a natural black type color. This hair is so cute and it's so full y'all know me i love full hair i cannot stand no thin wig no thin sewing no thin nothing if you're gonna wear the length baby you need to get enough hair for it period okay but this hair is 26 inches and this is in their texture body wave now when you get body wave i always want you guys to kind of you know know that body wave hair is always kind of going to be thicker than if you are going to be straight getting straight hair so if y'all were to get this wig in straight Please know that the hair is kind of going to have a different texture to it. It's not going to be as full and as thick because body wave hair is a little more, I'm not going to say coarse, but it's a little more full and it looks better, especially if you're going to be curling the hair. It holds like no other. And so I got so many messages. Is this how the hair came? Blah, blah, blah. And I just was like, no, it wasn't, the, you know, the regular body wave pattern, but I did go in and crimp it. So that's pretty much what I'm going to be showing y'all today. Like I said, this hair is 26 inches. I'm going to show y'all how it falls when I'm done crimping the hair. And as y'all see, the crimps are still pretty much in. It has a nice little wave pattern to it. I have not crimped my hair in like three or four days. So this is just the effect of me brushing it out and all that. But like I said, it holds a really, really good curl. So, but yeah, I'm just going to go in and crimp this hair. It's nothing major to it at all. And yeah. When I tell y'all crimping hair takes mad long, I was literally sitting up here crimping this week for three hours. Took hella long. And this hair really not even black. If you look at it like close up, like I'm looking at it in person, it's more of a brown color, but it's actually really, really cute. So I'm not mad at it. But really with crimping, it's no method to it. You're just gonna take a piece of hair. And these are the bed head crimping iron, if y'all didn't know. Uh, you're just gonna take it and press where you wanna start. Leave it on there for a good amount of seconds. And move it down and you want to go up while it's hot it's going to make it mold into that place and you just want to hold it up hold it hold it and yeah it just takes a long time though i ain't gonna count it takes a minute to crimp here to crimp especially crimping a full hair wig i did my friend right here i crimped her real hair and it took like 15 minutes this takes mad long i don't know if it's because of the length or the thickness i feel like this hair is at least 250 density i may be mistaken but this hair gotta be 250 density or 200 all the information will be down below in the description box but it gotta be one or the other because this hair is super thick i do think it's 200 though but the lace is okay, y'all. I try my best to blend the lace. It's not as late as some of my other ways have been. I feel like if you stay kind of close or if you look at me in a different light, you can probably clock my lace. Not gonna lie, I have melted lace, you know, a little thinner. But I still think I finessed it kind of in a way and it still looks good. But I'm gonna go ahead and crimp my hair and I'm gonna talk some more about the hair and you know, give you all the specs, all the ins and outs, what I've been through and all these different stuff. y'all 
I am Dylan. This is so cute. And it, okay, y'all know when you get body wave hair, it don't stay in the body wave texture. This kind of reminds me of how body, body wave hair would come just naturally. Like, it might be a little straight up here, but let me show y'all the back. That's how long it is. I'm sure if you straighten it, it'll be longer. But I just love this hair, this style. I'm gonna wear my hair like this for my birthday. I want it, of course, to be a little longer. But let me put a little let me put a little bit of gloss on. So yeah, this is pretty much it. That is how I, you know what I'm saying, get my crimps. This part right here is a little standing up, but it's going to go down eventually. But I just feel like it just looks so freaking cute. Sometimes I like to roughen it up a little bit just to give it a little more body. You know, I like to separate it just a little bit, but not too much. And... Y'all can't tell me. This is perfect. This is vacation hair. This is slay day hair. This is date night hair. This is whatever you want to make it. And I just think this is super cute. And I feel like it can look cute on anybody. It looks cute with any color and everything. But yes, y'all, I got to tell y'all, I do enjoy this Julia hair. It is so, so soft. So, 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 so soft. Barely get any tangle. If anything, a very minimum tangle, not going to lie. But that's because I don't fully wrap the hair up at night. I just put a scarf over my frontal and I just let the rest of the hair be because it's crimped. And I really don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't really be wanting to manipulate the hair if that makes any sense so i just leave it out so it can just keep its wave i'm trying to i can braid it which i should probably do but i be lazy i ain't even gonna lie y'all i have not been rough my hair like the my last couple installs i have not been rough my hair i just be being lazy as soon as i because i be up so late like by the time i get to you know washing my face and everything i just don't even do the full routine i haven't been doing my night routine nothing so i really need to get better with that and get back on it but yeah y'all this hair is from julia hair i want to thank them for sponsoring this video please remember that they only send you hair to review they only send you the hair to review they do not pay you to give them a good review say you love everything about the hair say oh this is the best hair i've ever had they don't pay you for that they pay you simply to give your honest opinion. And my honest opinion is that I like this hair. And I feel like I get a lot of that. Like, do they send the YouTubers the better hair? Do you really like this hair? Like, people comment on my pictures or DM me, do you really like this hair for real before I buy it? Like, no, I'm not going to lie and say I don't like the hair. The only misconception and the only difference between probably me and someone purchasing this hair is the longevity of how long you will wear the hair. Me personally, I do not wear hair that long. So, I am not manipulating, you know what I'm saying? I'm not doing much to the hair. But I am also a person who knows how to take care of hair. And I have been wearing weave for a while. So, I pretty much know how, you know what I'm saying, to take care of hair. And to make it last as long as possible. Because when I first started wearing weave, y'all, I had me one set of bundles. And those bundles was every install. And I probably installed those bundles like six or seven times, maybe more. So that's another thing. Just know how to take care of your hair. Watch some videos. Don't be drowning your hair in product. Don't do that. Do not put no product in your weave. That's just me though. I don't put no product in my hair. Maybe something super duper light and a quality product that's not going to weigh the hair down. 
yeah but nothing super heavy especially if it's not curly hair that's number one and number two just you know what i'm saying try to use as little bit of heat on your hair as possible try and do a style that you know you can wrap up and you know can save over the week or so maybe try and put heat on your hair probably twice out the week maybe if that maybe once i know i don't put heat on my weave you know that much because you know it's just treated like it's your real hair you're not gonna be flat on your real hair every single day are you if you are then you different i know i'm not so just treat it like your own hair you know what i'm saying take care of it and you should have a good experience but me personally i think this hair is really nice it had good lace on it i just being so lazy with the install so it's not super duper flawless like i wanted it but it still looked good like from right here you can't you know what i'm saying you can't really see but yeah that's pretty much it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed go ahead and shop with julia hair all the links will be down below in the description box for you to purchase and yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next freaking video. Can you see my lace now? No, don't, don't, don't okay. try me. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Rashawn. Today's video is brought to you by Julia Hair. They were kind of to send me another unit to review for you guys. But as always, before we get into the specs of this unit and what I think about it straight out the pack, Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. So if I must say so myself, I laid that joint down. You hear me? <laughs> Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from Julia Hair. It is their 13 by 6 transparent lace front curly wig. It comes in a natural color, and the starting price for this unit is $78.46. Now, obviously, depending on the specs you get for your unit, the price will go up. So let's go ahead and talk about the specs really quick. You can either get this unit in a 13 by 6 transparent lace or regular lace unit, or you can get it in a 13 by 4 regular lace unit. When I say regular lace, I mean like a light brown or brown lace, depending on what they offer on this site. This unit also comes in 150 or 180% density. I got mine in 150% density and 18 inches so my unit is hundred and fifty eight dollars and sixty four cents but don't worry they do have their anniversary sale starting on the 8th so you can get extra money off on top of the coupon code that I already have that will be linked down below as well so make sure you go ahead and use all them savings okay if you happen to be someone who just wants to get this actual curl pattern in a closure wig you guys know I did a closure wig last week it does come in bundles in a closure but you can pay the five dollars extra to get them to make the wig for you if you don't want to do it yourself okay look at that we checking all price points and expertise okay checkmate now i just saw them put down the curl this unit was a little bit tighter but i did go in and co-wash the unit and then i let it air dry i don't have any tingling with this unit however i'm still getting shedding with this unit when i pull on it i only got a little bit of shedding during the co-wash when i'm pulling on it now i'm mainly getting shedding here in the front so i'm thinking that's more so because of the pre-plucking that i did then when i put it on i put some mousse in my hair and then i use my revlon diffuser pew, pew, to liven up these curls a little bit as you can see the hair is a little bit bushier but i actually wanted that
that for this look. Because I told you guys I got this in a 150% density, I normally get my curly units in 180. I like how full it is. So I really want this to be really big. So to do that, I had to use my diffuser. Um, what the? That just popped right off of there. Uh-uh. There we go. But you guys know I love my diffuser. It is detachable. So you can still blow dry your hair like normal, okay? So you can just pop that joint on there and you blow dry the hair and it helps with the curls. It makes them bigger and, you know, controls the frizz, things like that. So obviously my light is on back there so you can see the light kind of shining through which lets me know the hair is not as thick as I would like it to be. But this is definitely more of a natural type of curl so if you don't like a lot of hair or big hair, this will be just fine for you. Me personally, I like big hair, okay? So 180 will be my ideal, you know, density for a curly unit. This unit did come pre-plucked um, but it's very, very beginner pre-plucked meaning they pluck just enough to get you started and then if you want to wear that, you can. But I was like, you know what? I did that last time. I didn't pluck it. I showed you guys how I can rock it out the pack. So this time I'm going to go ahead and pluck it. And y'all, I must say I plucked this joint to perfection. <laughs> I feel so myself okay a hundred points to me I am in love with how I plucked this unit and how I laid it down and how I put down my baby hairs look at this hairline do y'all see this hairline I did it yes I did it yes I did it on both sides sis based on how I plucked this joint to perfection you can definitely pull this joint up into like a little ponytail and rock it like that okay okay sis mm, mm, mm. and again if you don't want to pluck your unit you don't have to okay you guys have seen me put my units on plenty of times without plucking any units and still swooping them down and y'all be quick to say you laid that joint sis so don't be gassing me if it's a lie <laughs> So if you guys want to follow suit and do the same thing, okay, do you, boo. I'm there for it. I did go on with some heat on top of here because obviously it is a curly unit, so you want to flatten that out a little bit if you choose to. Um, and then I went in with my concealer and my powder into my parting space to brighten that up. And that's how she's looking, okay? So again, this is 18 inches. It comes down just at my chest. And then this is how that looks from the side. And then this is how it looks to the back, all right? You can definitely pin this up, move the hair down like that, give you a little ponytail vibe, all right, okay? See what I'm doing? What's happening, Captain? This will get you right just in time to go ahead and step outside, okay? Strut into the mailbox, to the kitchen, to the backyard, to the grocery store. I'm gonna be slaying this hair like it's mine, okay? Flip. This look good, y'all. This, ooh, wee, show the work. <laughs> oh, I did that. I did that. You can even put on like a little headband, like y'all, that's cute. It look good. It looks, look at that hairline. Look at the hairline. <laughs> Can you see my lace now? No, don't, don't, don't okay. try me. Okay. I'm just saying. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay. He can't see it. He, he playing games today. She look good, y'all. She look... <laughs> She look good. The direct link for my unit as well as my specs will be listed down below so you guys can check that out. Don't forget to use my coupon code as well as take advantage of that anniversary sale starting on May 8th. Be sure to save you guys some coins wherever you can, okay? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.